Kyle, fresh off the plane, welcome back to the UK. It's been a while, but good news, you've secured your visa to cover you for the PDC tour in 2017. Just bring us up to speed with the situation. Yeah, um, we've got a 12 month visa, sports visa, so I'm covered for the whole period of that. Um, we applied for a three one, got a, got a one year visa, but just a matter of back in, back in town and uh, work from there. So after this year, it's again, reapply for 2018. Yeah, yeah, we might apply, apply for a uh, longer one as well, see how it goes, but if we keep getting years, then it's okay. Okay, excellent. It must have been an incredibly frustrating time for you missing out on a number of TV majors at the end of last year, including, of course, the World Championship. Yeah, you know, um, I was high hoped all the way until the last minute, pretty much, um, before the draw was made. Uh, yeah, the Players' Championships and the Worlds, I missed out on. Um, nothing much else to say Dave Matt it was um it's just it's just uh, you know I uh, sat home watched it I enjoyed it but a bit upset I wasn't playing okay so you, you sort of touched on it a bit there I know a number of players don't tend to watch darts on TV when they're not in an event but you sort of kept up to speed with what was going on at Ale Alexandra Palace I watched a couple of games you know I didn't it was it's 2 3 a.m in the morning back home so if I was up I'd watch it if not I wouldn't Stay awake for it. Because of the time difference, yeah. yeah. Um, I get up for the midnight, the midnight toilet break that everyone has, and it was around dark time, so I'd watch it. Uh, there's a couple of good games on there, but at, as you said, I did miss it a lot. Um, there's a lot of money to miss out on in the end, Matt. So, uh, yeah, it was uh, it was a big hip pocket takeover. Okay, so you, you've been back home in Australia for the last few months. You've been spending some quality time with the family. You've been able to celebrate Christmas at home so that must have been good for you it was you know first time in four years I spent Christmas at home with the family but we're looking at coming across here for Christmas I had them all everything all sorted and I had the money for them to come across and then it all happened and so I spent home Christmas you know she was upset she was happy for me to be home but she was upset she didn't have to get a white Christmas that she always wanted to but um no it was good to be home he he enjoyed all the Christmas maybe presents. bring them across this year oh we're looking at that too you know it's now we can't get knocked back for Christmas so it's, it's certainly the plan Oh, great stuff and you last threw a competitive dart at the European Championships last October where you in fact reached the quarterfinals so I bet you can't wait to get back on the hockey I can't you know as I said before I, I didn't throw darts for about a month and a half whilst I was home and um, had a couple of exhibitions just gone and it's got me back in the mood for throwing darts again I, I threw quite well in my last exhibition so I'm looking forward to it and um, always was hunger there to play in it but it's just uh, Unfortunately, I couldn't play. And looking at the order of merit, you're currently sitting in 30th place. Your ambitions must to be get as high as you can this year. I'd say top 20, be realistic, and then uh, whatever else comes with a bonus. You know, of course you want to get to the top five in the world and top one in the world, but if I can get to the top 20 by the end of the year and uh, work on it from there, then we're laughing. Okay, Kyle, great to have you back. Good luck. Thank you.